Chef Pennington here. Today we're going to be doing a remake of a dish that you can get at Whole Foods on their buffet. Very healthy dish. I've added this to my breakfast regimen and I've been feeling really great lately and I really think it has to do with the fact that I'm eating broccoli for breakfast. Who knew? Broccoli for breakfast. Broccoli does have the master antioxidant in it. It's called glutathione. That's in the article. Really cool stuff. Uh, I suggest maybe you guys think about making this yourself. I mean, we're always looking for something new for breakfast and everything out there has kind of been done, this and that. So this is truly a fresh idea for breakfast. And it actually it tastes really good. I promise we're gonna have some really great flavors here. So we start out with a half of a red onion and we did a julienne cut on it. Pretty thin, because we wanted to you know, perfume the dish with a little bit of that sweet onion. So right here we've got a Fresno chili. I'm just de-seeding it and de-ribbing it. I like to lay them flat on themselves and do another julienne cut. We do eat with our eyes a little bit, so getting a little color in there. Um, the Fresno chilies, they're not hot. They're a little bit, they're a little hotter than a bell pepper, and a bell pepper is just sweet, so that, that should give you an idea how great they are. So we've got some Greek yogurt here. You could use mayonnaise. Um, they do, do they do use an in-house made mayonnaise at Whole Foods, so there's a little healthy replacement for you. Honey, anytime you get a chance to cook with honey, I suggest you do it. And the end of days, when we, you know, the world is no longer, and we don't have daily vitamins, they're saying that. Honey is going to be your daily vitamin, which is really cool. Some garlic salt here. Salt wakes everything up. Salt equals big flavor. Plus, garlic's really good. This is one of my favorite finds recently is dehydrated blueberries. I never knew they existed. I can imagine you could put them in candies and other confections. Uh, it just adds more healthiness. We know blueberries are super great for you. I did write an article about them. They're number one in antioxidants when it comes to our fruits. I'll have a link for you below into that article. It's a great read. So we've got ourselves some granola here. This is actually it was coconut granola. Never heard of it, so I had to grab it up. We also have some cashews in there. They've been cut up to mouth size. This is a cool find that I found the other day for barbecuing. It just adds a little extra heat. It's just different. You can use Creole seasoning if you don't have any of that good stuff. Bring everything together really well. Mix our friends together. And we're almost done here. Now there's an optional ingredient you guys can add that takes it over the top. And everyone likes to say, Everything's better with our friend bacon. So I'm gonna show you guys a really quick and easy way to cook bacon. No more skillets, no more putting it in the oven, all that stuff you hear on Food Network all the time. One plate, one paper towel, three strips of bacon, three minutes and we're done. And it's perfect. So you can see, three minutes, the, the paper towel sucks up the oil, so it's easy clean. Look guys, that's bacon, beautiful. It's not fatty or anything. I mean, you know, we rendered the fat out of it. It's in the paper towel, it's pliable. So the way I do bacon, I mean, if I'm doing a lot, I do like to roast it off in the oven in a roasting rack, so I got the time, but this is quick. We're making a quick little breakfast thing here. It sets up really nicely in the refrigerator, and it gets a little better each day it passes, so make a batch, it's good for a week. You know, it's got a little bit of sweetness in there um, with the blueberries, so kids might really like it. So we got some bacon in there, deliciousness, and we have broccoli crunch now. Really delicious. Hope you guys enjoy this. Really hope you try. If you really love it or you added a different ingredient, let us know. Facebook, Pinterest, check us out. If you guys liked it, hit the up the like button and have a good one.